some parents are outraged because their kids' after-school programs are being cut. Many of them are now scrambling to find child care. Monica Morales headed over to the Lower East Side. Don't hurt our children. That's what I say. To say this Lower East Side mom is angry is an understatement. She's livid at Mayor Bloomberg and the city. Both her son and daughter attend a free after school program here at PS 142. It's getting cut next year by the city, and like so many parents, she works till five and can't afford childcare. So now what does she do? There's no way I'm going to get here by 3 o'clock. I have no friends or family in the neighborhood. So what's going to happen after this year? I may have to quit my job, and that devastates me. She, along with other outraged parents, say they're waging war against the city to restore funding on Facebook and Twitter and even protesting with their kids. The program is called Educational Alliance, and it provides a safe place for more than 150 kids between 3 and 6 p.m. every day after school. They put on shows like this one to learn music and art and get much-needed tutoring, too. How do you tell your kids this will be the last curtain call? How do you tell them that? I explained it to my daughter and she broke down into tears. The cost, $350,000 to keep the program running. Its program director says that the program is really priceless for what it does for these kids. These children, well, that they care for are the poorest of the poor and could now be out on the streets. A lot of these kids don't have anywhere else to go. Absolutely. A lot of our students that we're serving here, they come from shelters, foster care. And their final curtain call is sometime next month, and the show is Taming of the Shrew. They have a message, though, for Mayor Bloomberg. Save their program and do it for the children. I voted for you, now you vote for our kids. That's all we asked for. After almost a decade of serving Lower East Side children, these parents hope the city will have a heart. On the Lower East Side, Monica Morales, PIX11 News.